Hi everybody, Mike Grasso here from Private Poop Games with a game development video about Drilly Willis, a game I'm currently developing for PC and Mac. I've put some gameplay videos up, but I haven't really done enough in terms of explaining what I'm doing in Drilly Willis and what makes it particularly unique. So today I wanted to do that. This one is particularly going to cover sound effects. <laughs> Uh, I spent a lot of time making sure these sound really good. If you've played the demo, you can probably hear some differences in the drill and the screw shooter and how it affects enemies. I uh, really wanted to make it something where it wasn't really shrill and horrible, but it had plenty of action to it. So you can see that there is... Uh, the game does have some really killer tunes in it, and I, uh, I will do... A game development video about the music at some point in time because they are these are some really cool killer tunes that I'm really proud of that I put in it but today I want to focus on sound effects beginning with boom boxwell so blah, 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 blah. as you can see now I've added uh, we're in the dialogue you get sort of a gibberish sound when you talk to them that reflects whatever their emotional state is boom boxwell is very neutral he's your friend as the game goes on, so he has a very neutral sound. When we talk to Spatulo later, he's very upset, and we're going to hear a very different sound from him. So the other thing I love is all the enemies have very unique ways of responding to the drill. <laughs> you can see that uh, Gordon, the little snail a turtle sort of guy, he responds with this sort of flappy lip sound. <laughs> and that's very unique to him. Now all the enemies pretty much respond the same way to the screw shooter, but because they're responding with their voice to the drill, it is very much their own unique sound. I really wanted the uh, sort of the personalities of the monsters because these are some really, really, really bizarre monsters in this game that's intentional. I really wanted their personalities to come out. My favorite is, is by a long shot, I just love the the sound he makes when he when he gets drilled. It's this wonderful, guttural, just like unpleasant sound that I think is really cool for the scope and the feel of the game. <laughs> now going back to dialogue, I had mentioned that um, dialogue reflects their emotional state. So when I talk to Spatulo, who's clearly unhappy. <laughs> He's got sort of this gibberish sound that's really reflecting the fact that he's super upset about something. And he's, you know, just totally sort of an angry, depressed guy. Um, and depending on your actions, that might change later in the game. But for now, he is super upset. So as a result, uh, this is the first of me just kind of talking about different features of the game. This one is just sound effects today and a few of those things. Um, I'm hoping to have a Steam, wish a Steam page up so you can add it to your wish list. I'm hoping to do one on music. I'd like to do one on level design and character design and all that different stuff. But for right now, I hope you enjoy this one. Please hit subscribe before you go, and thank you for watching.